Ladies and gentlemen, today is a big one and one that I am super, super excited to kick off the series with because we're going to be going through, we're going to be watching all of the different, I mean, you already, you've already, you already read the title, all of the different Halo speedruns, starting obviously where it all began in one of the most underrated games of all time, Halo 1 Legendary, keep that in mind, Legendary, the hardest difficulty, Halo 1 in one hour and six minutes unbelievably fast so before we get started before we go any farther please 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 garish goblin i have both his twitch channel and his youtube channel linked down below i need you guys to go follow his twitch channel i need you to go subscribe to his youtube channel because this guy is an absolute beast absolute beast i'm so excited to see this i'm so excited to watch this and see New how content, in the world like, this is even humanly possible dude based on the new how game. i don't know N knowing that that's what i legitimately don't see. know and of course this knowing is where it all starts you know what's gonna we're we're, we're eventually gonna make it to every single channel. halo game every single one we're gonna react to a speed run from every single one it's and like... find everything but halo one is the oldest or you could AKA... be like me and play the same game for over five years <laughs> <laughs> what a legend what a legend what an absolute legend I like how I was just hopping over a thing. Dude, I, I'm excited for this run most of all because it's the oldest, aka it might have the most hilarious glitches actually of all time. I am so incredibly excited to see. Oh, hitting a little spawn barrier there. Checkpoint done. I don't keep it loaded, son. You'll have to find ammo as you go. <laughs> Bro, I I love how I, anybody anybody who is like my age and played the original Halo One, anybody my age or older, dude, it's so funny going back and looking at some of these games because it is actually unbelievably bad looking compared to what we thought it looked like. When I played this game, I literally thought it was like real life graphics, and that's that that is the nostalgia factor. Oh, he just killed the soldiers. <laughs> oh my god dude he's just rushing through everything i mean obviously it's a speed run but it, it's really funny to just see people exploding and stuff um and then obviously it's legendary as well D dude i don't even think i ever have beaten a halo on legendary i've done heroic but i don't think i uh, dude he's killing his own men so they stay out of the way so he can speed run faster absolutely brutal dude absolutely brutal that's insane. I mean, you, he's already almost died multiple times. He he is playing, of course, on legendary. So he's going to clear this hallway. Everything dies and moves on. Dude, it, it just, it really, really is funny to see how, how different this looks than how you remember it. I think it's my favorite part. The melee is so good, dude. A little crouch through the door. The pistol, man. The pistol. Okay, grab the health pack. Easy clap. Plasma pistol. Combat evolved, man. Who knew? Who knew? And I, I, my plan is obviously as well. Oh, that little grenade boost up. I don't know if he would have made that without the grenade or that was just a little added, like, safety. Um, dude, I, 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 the plan is I want to get through all of the Halo games before the next Halo game comes out so that we can react to multiple world record speedruns. Like, uh, like, like with Halo and in, in the new game, and I, I don't know how it's gonna work because obviously it seems like the campaign is not gonna be linear. It's almost like an open world Halo, and I mean they they've delayed it, so hopefully it's really good. Hopefully it doesn't suck. I really, really hope. Warning: blast doors closing. We have to use the ship's maintenance access ways. Follow the nav point; it will lead you to an opening. All right, there's there's just nothing he can do there to make it go any faster. He's gotta wait for this door. Dude, it, it's gonna be it's just gonna be so fun. This that this shot right here straight up looks like something out of Doom, dude. It really does. Like the original Dooms, the OG Dooms. We've reacted to the new good Dooms, but not quite the uh <laughs> not quite the old ones. I don't think I really have any plans for that. The only time I really want to react to like old, old games like this is when either A, they're super, super entertaining and like interesting to watch. Hence, like this game, Legend of Zelda, Ocarina of Time, Majora's Mask. 
I'm planning on w watching all of those. There's so many good games out there, and I, I just, and I've seen your comments. I know you guys want me to watch Outlast, so we will get to the Outlast speedrun as well. I, I can confirm we will get to the Outlast world record speedrun. I do ever since ever since I did Resident Evil 7, people have just been begging for it. So I'm gonna do Resident Evil 2, 3, basically all the remastered Resident Evils, just because they're pretty and they're nice to look at, and YouTube likes new games. At the end, at the end of the day. Oh, wow. Okay. That was clean. That was clean. Freaking garish goblin, man. So what was that? Plus five seconds on the uh, on the Chief? average segments? Chief, can you hear me? At last. Are you all right? At last. Oh, that's cool. I didn't even notice down here. Down here, he has another video, I'm assuming, from his previous fastest run ever. just to run Halo CE. I detected multiple Covenant dropships on I approach. think this is his pre Covenant this is his personal Covenant. best over here so we're gonna be able to see oh here we go first movement of the day he's using that uh grenade boost to uh to get him up on this cliff or he's I mean I, I honestly suppose to... this game is very GPU limited or like I could I could buy a freaking 30, 90 right now, and it wouldn't even boost my frames that, that much. <laughs> Bro, that's probably true. On games this old, the limitations are not in your computer's hardware anymore. They are literally in the in the game itself, the way the game is actually made. They never well, knew a 30, 90 would exist graphics. when they made this game and coded this game, which is really but cool when you think about it. Anyway. Like, how much has video games actually progressed since this like era and it's and, 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 and the answer is a ton i mean we'll see as we go through the halo games how much better and better and better they look my man is pre-sniping things with a pistol cross map pre-sniping things i like how halo games it always goes from like the pistol the the pistols being really good to the to the pistols uh not being good it happens every single time pistols been good pistol if useless you... Pay attention to that you can do that where you actually kill them before you kill the covenant it's better that way <laughs> what killing if you see them killing the good guys like really <laughs> close together oh oh that dude that pre name like was beautiful I, sh I should try to pay more attention to that because Then it just means that this ship's gonna spawn instantly. Dude, is he? Dude, he's pre-killing things out of there. Things he literally can't even see. I'm pretty sure he just killed something there. All right, I'm gonna. I have to sneeze. <laughs> oh god, I, I I missed that entire. I sneezed and I missed that entire fight. I actually just missed the whole thing. <laughs> do IT bag. <laughs> that was so funny. <laughs> yeah, IT. You ever just life. sneeze and then miss an entire cutscene? <laughs> because, because same. Oh gosh. All right, here we go. I'm excited for this. What is nah. this boost gonna be? No, uh, but. Oh, he he pre-killed something right there. In Halo, I basically pre-naded something. Where's that nade landing? Oh, it landed on that backside. Basically, that right that nade right now. there was the one that landed early. The optimization, <laughs> man. Holy. Just like. Unlegendary, too. Somebody just repeatedly clicking their thumbsticks can have such a big, uh. Like. Reaction on some people. What, what is he talking about? <laughs> I missed it. Oh, the 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 absolute a dude. I actually, is he playing controller, or is he playing? Uh, wait. This is Echo I'm guessing he's playing. Is he playing? He must be Anybody playing controller. Then again, he said he was playing on PC, so no, he's playing on PC. Wait, how? Is this a, is this an emulator or is it a? Wait, this is playing Halo. Oh my gosh, you know, there are the people who just do it for fun. He's just killing the guards, people man. Moves, who just run Coming around the map and just teabag everybody. <laughs> but then there are also those who get really salty. And 
Hey, teabag, teabag you because they get really salty. Bro, I'm a big salty gamer. I'm a big salty gamer. Oh, here we go. Warthog time, baby. Oh, I'm excited for any and all Warthog boost if they exist. Dude, sl slow teabagging is the, the classy way of doing it, right? <laughs> slow teabagging is the classy way of doing it. Crouch like, one if, if I ever dude, that is the classic. That's definitely the way to do it. Crouch one second, stand Someone one second. Every time, dude. So it must lead I've hacked into the Covenant Battle Network. Broadcasting tactical data on but yeah, I don't know with uh it with what's it called it is more for fun but when you see Chief, when you see like people your shoot your body that's definitely salt oh dude it's like that's pure just salt when people start shooting your body I, I always love how I have conversations with people who literally have recorded this like five months ago <laughs> they, 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 they've, they've just not even looked at this in uh, like three months and I'm just ha talking to them like I'm having a conversation it's great. I wonder if there's a lot of possibility. Oh, wait, that was that was hot. That was actually sick right there. Who's going to hit that? No. Oh, my God. He just kills all of the friendlies. He really does. Well, that's a fancy driving there. Bro. <laughs> Why does he kill? I mean, is there a point to it or is it just for fun? Yo, I'm like frame perfectly tied with BB. Wait, yeah, look at that. Be, Wait, like, he actually he is the almost frame ridiculous. perfectly tied. The captain really gave them hell. That's insane, dude. And for somebody to be so we good at a game Keith that it literally he can run it two times in a row and it looks the like, exact I same. I literally play the game just by watching my PB video. That's <laughs> how tight I am right now. <laughs> That's sick. That's sick, bro. I I I effing love the speedrun speedrunning community, man. Yeah, for real, for real. Please go sub to this man, in every way, shape, and form. I'm excited for the last uh, the last mission because if it, it, it's been a long time since I played this game, but the last mission, if I remember correctly, is is pretty poggers, dude. It's a, it's definitely a Fortnite poggers moment. Right. Oh, he just quick, just quickly snatching a sniper rifle there. No, no, okay, no worries. If I try really hard. Let's see if I can get ahead. He's trying to get ahead of the PB. Wait, how, I wonder what his final time ends up being, dude. The launches out of the car are so cool. I love it so much. <laughs> Kill us all. Yes. He is. He's just barely ahead of his PB now. I love how he always comes back to the car too. Ooh. It's legendary, so that those bullets, while they may not look like much, are very, very scary. Search the interior of this structure before we leave. I think I'm ahead by like a couple of frames. Yeah. Yeah, he's ahead by like half a second, if that. If that go 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 go, dude. Halo Halo oh, is, is the goat is of uh of really like just map design, Where dude. We will see a huge gap merge. Possibly. Oh, There's no way shot. he just turn and yucked that nade that far. That was unbelievable. The gap that formed already. So he had to like skirt in almost. and get his tail around because he did. I checked. He did that both in his world record run, the one we're watching, and in and, and, and his PB run. He could have made that turn tighter, but he definitely like hit some sort of load zone or checkpoint type thing that allows him to progress. Because obviously, when you are speedrunning a game this old, you know literally every single trick that exists. Like, actually, well, every single trick. To, like, I feel like when I do this, where I. Constantly There's watch the BB video. It actually the the um, encourages me to try harder. Oh, he got another. He got another dude. <laughs> I love the voice acting. <laughs> you have to stay with the Marines. It's, it, it it really is just like the game got so much better over time. I mean, the game was already like iconic. 
Oh, that's why he got the dude on there so the dude could help him shoot and clear the area faster, which you have to do to progress, which is why he's shooting everything. That, that's why he got the dude. Also, is he like, is he even reloading or is he just glitching something with the reload? Pretty crazy. <laughs> he blew up the man, dude. He blew up the man. He's being held on a Covenant cruiser, the Truth and Reconciliation, a ship I disabled before we abandoned the. Why does he keep killing his homies, dude? The Truth and Reconciliation touched down on a desert plateau, roughly 300 kilometers up spin. So I guess in this, it, it looks like in this time he has plenty of time, time to just like hang out, chill, and then he needs to hop on There's here whenever it's time. Get aboard and let's get out of here. All right, easy. Truth and reconciliation. Here we go. Yeah, this is definitely my last attempt now. The enemy has captured he hasn't said it yet. He hasn't said this run sucks. Yo, is my is my guy drinking like Sprite Golden right there? Did you see that? Dude, I'll, also another thing I'll say: speedrunners seem to have the absolute nicest communities ever. I I freaking love speedrunners communities. Every single time they have their chats on screen, they're always just the coolest people, man. You just use a different screen capture for the video. Why does he keep? Ca I guess maybe it's kind of like Call of Duty where. You have to, you're like, your teammates have to reach the, reach the checkpoint, not you. So maybe they're, he's literally killing them so that they don't have to reach the checkpoint. Is that what it, is that the reason? Oh my gosh, his health is actually one. Woo! That was, that was scary right there. He knows all of the enemy spawns with a sniper rifle. Also, this requires a good amount of, like, actual precision and accu uh, accuracy. You have to be very accurate. Yeah, the way he's moving, he's definitely playing PC. So, he, so he's starting the sniper rifle reload as he stores it, and it's allowing him to reload the sniper rifle while having another gun out. Yeah, you can hear it reloading. That's what he's doing. He's like storing the rifle as he's reloading it. It's pretty cool. It's a cool, uh... Whee! That dude did not die. This is, this is the most impressive part so far. Streams. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Did he get him? I thought he missed, but I guess he got him. Bro, his sniper accuracy is actually on point. That's unbelievable. And he just keeps no scoping dudes out of the ship without actually being able to see him. So impressive, dude. Nade right on the platform. Kill everybody. Oh, this is legendary. Bro, this is so impressive, man. This is so impressive, man. Holy crap. That was so cool to watch, man. Okay. Bro, those those guys. Those guys were a... Were a you, you, tell me you didn't crap your pants every time you saw one of those guys. In the uh, in the game. And we have it. We have it. Our very first big glitch in the game. Our very, very first big glitch. So he he exploded the tank to send him up through the ceiling by standing in a specific spot while he blew it up, which is allowing him to glitch on top of the actual area. So underneath, 
is where you're supposed to be like going through the level. He just jumps through the wall, jumps on top of another one and through the ceiling because the ceiling doesn't have a roof on it. It's not an actual light. Like it looks, it, it's there, but it's not actually like a textured ceiling is the best way I can describe it. Like you can see it, but you can't, like you can jump through. It doesn't actually have any like solidity to it. All right, here we go. To the belly of the beast. I thought he was just doing that to kill his teammates again, but it turns out that was, there was actually a reason to do that. Little three nades right there. Woo! <laughs> that, those pre nades were not for enemies though. Those pre nades were for a huge grenade boost, like a triple grenade boost right there. But as he grabbed the overshield, you have invincibility for like that second when you're grabbing the, uh, the overshield. So he actually didn't take any damage or didn't die. So pretty much every single opportunity that you get the overshield, you're gonna be able to do some crazy business, dude. That's so sick. That was so cool. And the amount of precision, I'm actually blown away by how much precision is actually required in this. Cause you have to be shooting enemies. It's legendary. Silver shield is almost done. Not completely, but almost, almost done. Oh wait, he has another, he has another roundabout on it. Okay, now it's almost done. I just love Halo physics too. Halo physics are so cool. There's so much cool stuff you can do it, even in the multiplayer. I just can't, I can't wait for the next game, man. I really, really can't. Little double collateral there. <laughs> It's like the sniper mission. Dude, just the, just the sick, like, like, like he just prenated the dude with the energy sword from across the arena. Like, what the heck? Oh, okay. Well, what are you thinking? What are you thinking? This dude, this dude hates teammates. Little nade on that guy right there. Eee, his health, dude! All right, get that reload off. Dude, this just makes me feel bad every single time that I died on Heroic. It just actually makes me feel so bad. Hey, dude, I gotta know why he's shooting his teammates. I, I gotta know why he's doing it. What, for what reason? Little invis guys right there. Beautiful. It's gotta be something with like, you need a certain number of, uh, of enemies to, to do these certain parts. That was perfect, dude. The the uh, the chat is popping off. Yeah, Glod. <laughs> That's sick. I bro, I have I haven't loved these guys, man. That's pretty good. Somewhere under this island, the cartographer is a map room that will lead us to Halo's control center. The island has multiple. He's so far ahead of PB right now. Thirty-seven. Yeah, it's kind, I'm kind of blocking it here, but thirty-seven seconds. Should I go up top now? Um, we're, we're still missing a few splits. 37 seconds behind time right there. 21.42. That would definitely put that. Oh, he's check. He's like checking between all yeah. of his, uh, all of his different splits. Best split times. Actually, wait. I don't remember what my... I smell it. People in chat are saying it. World record. YouTube, I was here. But that, this <laughs> should be my new best split for that. I'm pretty positive. That was so clean, dude. He didn't miss a shot that entire time. If Flinks wants commentary, okay. All right. I here we go. I some light commentary for this attempt. I, I like that there's a. It looks like there is a path into the interior. <laughs> of the I like that there's a. What's it called? Yeah, I mean he's of that course gonna grab the, uh, the building. grab the car. That's faster. With the warthog. 
you can do a trick to get past the door that locks. I'll do it in a second. He's starting to do a live commentary on the run since he thinks he's gonna get world record. What an absolute baller, dude. What an actual absolute baller. He's like, oh, I'll start doing some live commentary since this run is like gonna be world record. So that way, so that way everyone can understand what I'm doing. Oh, that was sick. I'm gonna get plasmas from that elite. Wait, what did he say? I'm gonna get plasmas from that elite. I, I I don't understand what he's saying. What is it? What did he say there? Ooh, the little optimization to I bounce just off have that. To press this button and then go back up. Dude, and what? Hopefully, a... there's an over shield. What a baller! The cause you'd be a rile, not wings. Double Jackal. I'm not gonna go for that. Really unlucky. Oh! You basically can't go for that unless you like headshot both of those Jackals instantly. Otherwise they'll have so much time to just delete your overshield. But you can do another nade stack there. If you have enough overshield. So he you need did... the overshield. You need three grenades. Three frags to get to the. So basically, because to, to be he was unlucky, he had two jackals spawn there. He can't do the lose. second nade boost. And apparently, people in the chat are saying they've never seen that. Yeah, you can die. Bro, this looks like the yeah, hardest that, thing ever. That's a good SC. Like I mean, overall, I mean, that's pretty good. Obviously, aside from all the other insane stuff that he's been doing. Eee, there's so many enemies. Okay. Actually, dude, there were two commentary redeems. I completely missed the first one. All right, so now he's minus 30 seconds. Now he's minus 30 seconds on the run. Should I go up? Okay, I... I think okay. We're I'm gonna be blocking uh, one of Halo the splits. Runs, IELs don't have starting or ending cutscenes. It only times the you know part where you're actually playing. So this level is interesting. I'm just gonna have to get past this part first. And this part sucks sometimes. All right, let's see it. Like this should be pretty straightforward, and it is. But... His health, man. His health. Like gets this elite so low. through the wall. See that? So you have to be ready for him. Dude, it's, it's just it's crazy because he makes it look easy, but ever like almost all these enemies can just one v one you if you're not if you're not good enough. Okay, so that was pretty easy. Now there's a trick here. Which is pretty precise. Interesting. The you line up on the floor. Natural, not then just I wonder if the rings environment have to systems move are malfunctioning correctly or here. The designers wanted the installation to have inclement weather. This is fire team Zulu requesting immediate assistance from any UNSC forces. Does anyone copy? <laughs> so you, you just do like a series of small movements. Of just to just to force the pilot to make certain movements and crash into the wall and steal his banshee and since the so that trick all only works because the banshee spawn is always the same so when you enter the loading zones the banshee always spawns in the same spot facing that same way that's so insane as, long as you line yourself up on the floor in the same spot you can easily force the banshee to just like do this the same movements every time bro that is so so sick you're I, i'm guessing you're i i mean maybe i'm wrong so but i'm guessing you're not supposed to have a banshee in this based. not this at all actually be super stupid or at least not this early and this man just forced a pilot to jump off 
and bail out of his banshee and then steal it. That is so clean. Oh yeah, and now the rest of the level doesn't spawn anything on the map. <laughs> Not this level is kind of a blessing for speedrunners because the level you can still finish the level. <laughs> Like, oh, there's not like triggers. triggers. Yeah, he literally just said it. So there, no, a lot of the time, you can physically get to the end of the level, That's but the it won't finish because there's no because you and haven't hit the correct the triggers. Levels, you couldn't do anything like this, where you just literally skip everything. Yeah, because you have to do certain things in the mission in order kind of for it to TB actually finish. TB uses the exact same map from this level, but on TB you have to hit like pretty much every trigger just to be able to activate the ending trigger. But this level is not the opposite from that. Not like that at all. All you gotta hit is the ending trigger. Bro, imagine having to like literally play all of this normally, and this man literally is just flying through the entire mission. And now I'm gonna do another trick here that's just as precise as the first one. And then I'm gonna do the same thing. Get inside the control room. Or you know to that to the last button. What am I witnessing? <laughs> so it's just a teleport. I didn't explain teleports yet. That is um, unbelievable. How? How? You do quite a lot of them on this in this run. The, the first one being the one on TNR with the Wraith. And then those Banshee teleports are really nice. Uh, they are pretty unforgiving. Like... He, dude, he, it literally looks like he's just you, playing you a recording. Really he's to, doing everything so perfectly right here. Be consistent. And even when you think you align it properly, it sometimes fails. Not consistent strategy. All right, he's going to use a little grenade boost to get on top of this uh, terrain here. Pretty self-explanatory. Bro, I love that this guy... Dude, this guy is an absolute G. So here, I love I'm him. He getting inside the structure as quickly as possible. You can do a small nade, nade boost to get up on the hill. He, he literally there, really. knows he's going to get world record. He starts yeah, commentating you, you it halfway way, through. You can. You can jump straight to the button there, but you have to jump like as late as possible. It's really hard to get the timing. Mm, that's so many enemies. That's so many enemies for legendary, uh, I don't dude. I get hit by anything. Because... Grenade boost time. I'm gonna do a nade jump like this. Oh, he's like in the wall right now. Oh, now he's like underneath the wall. All right, then he's so just gonna go ahead and clip that's through there. That's actually one of my favorite tricks. That was sick. There, there's a nice flow to it. So the and console, boom. The trick there is not to jump. So you have to like jump, jump from one beam to the to the other but you're you don't actually press a jump there just walk that would it. be way too big of a jump oh the flood dude the flood it's finally happening so what you do instead is like, you like uncrouch you uncrouch <laughs> and that bumps you just enough for you to like get to the other side bro ha halo is the first modern horror game changed my mind with the flood? Now I just wanna make sure that this camo lasts all the way to the last room of this structure thingy. I wanna be able to do a nade jump without getting absolutely melted. 
by flood so many enemies look at his radar he has this camo <laughs> oh my god look at his health he literally has three of the baby bars left dude it is so enjoyable to watch someone absolutely annihilate this game freaking love it dude um, now i need a plasma weapon so this level is probably the second my second favorite level in the speedrun but this last part is one of the worst parts in the game <laughs> or you know it can be i'm guessing it's rng if you get a plasma weapon just because you have to kill two sentinels but this first of all the flood spawns here are rng Ugh. whether i can get a plasma weapon is rng and then whether the flood are actually gonna kill me is rng it's legendary okay well yeah. he basically everything is rng other other than me actually shooting the sentinels Ooh, that was a long range shot right there, my friend. Hey, this is a freaking dumbass sentinel spawn. Because he spawned like way off into the distance. Oh, I see. You, he needed the plasma weapon for that. Well, that that's fine. I mean, it still looked pretty darn fast to me there, brother. Only three seconds from gold with that sentinel spawn. I don't know how. Because it's the world record run, brother. Say this run sucks. Say it sucks. I just need it once. Bro, the flood kind of seemed like a speedrunner's worst nightmare. What no. was he? He needed that flood to hit him. Putting for that some guy's reason. arm off will make him run faster. <gasps> oh, here we go. He's right behind Which him. You see him on the radar? That. Now you just want to look at your radar. Make sure he's actually following you properly. Get him all the way here. You jump on top of his head. Now the good thing is that this guy is always a reviving flood. The, the flood <laughs> who spawns with a plasma rifle at the start. So you can do a teleport with reviving flood in this game so teleports are like and that's one of the only flood teleports that's actually consistent or oh the little boost the little boosts are really nice differently the teleport itself is actually really easy you don't really have to even do anything am i actually gonna so, die here what the hell so teleport oh that was actually the, the random part is the getting a reviving flood oh here so we go for the first door it's nice a little over shield easy easy the reviving flood is not actually rng based um but for everything else it is dude it looks like teleporting is almost like you're you're in two places at once like you're in you're in a place but the game is trying to like put something else in the place that you're in and then it just moves you you know what i mean it seems like that's what teleporting actually does and allows you to do so this level is just running through the hallways without dying and then uh, getting the blood bumps, basically. Bro, I love the animations in this game. The animations look so clean. All right, here we go. Big elevator time. You see all those lasers, everyone, everything fighting. I'm like barely ahead of PB. My PB is so good. <laughs> Damn it. That's got to be the worst feeling when you're so good, but you, you just, you haven't got the world record just yet, but it, it's frustrating because you feel like you're making no progress at all. Dude, look, it's literally almost frame perfect. Oh, no, no, never mind, never mind. He's just, he's you like do a, two a or three seconds ahead. With a carrier. I mean, technically you can do it with, with any flood, right? But only reasonable uh, way i thought he was gonna start riding one of those stories with a carrier but <laughs> i say i say reasonable but i don't actually mean reasonable 
is he waiting for? <laughs> the little music in the background. What, 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 what is he waiting for? I'm guessing Still something. Best split time. Something to spawn? Something nice. to kill? I guess that's what he was waiting for. Oh, hello. <laughs> All right. And I think, I think it, is he, wait, what, which, I'm trying to remember which part of the game this is. You oh. can do a <gasps> jump. No, I missed it. I didn't want to completely risk that. But you can do like a very wide jump there to skip a trigger. Which would make this door open earlier. No, it's not ideal world record pace. We're going to have we're going to have to end the run. We're, I mean, one, two, three. <sighs> Unbelievable. That's like that's like what? A three a three second time waste. We're going to have to kill the run. Original question. We're gonna have to kill the run. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, everyone. I didn't. I didn't want you to have to figure it out like this. But we're gonna have to kill the run. Oh my gosh, those things are so nasty. <laughs> it just jumps over. Them. <laughs> They're kind of like if, creepers if a little here, bit. Garrison, if I don't die here, I should be way out of PB. Does he die here in his PB? I'm guessing he dies here in his PB. I'm watching his PB at the watching same time down here. Twitch TV Garish Goblin. Yes, sir. Subscribe to this man's Twitch. I'm looking to see. Oh my gosh. So many enemies. Ugh. Oh yeah, he did die on his PB. So that was pretty standard. Yeah, he died there on his PB. He like immediately reloaded it, but he did die. The splits are insane, man. The splits are so uh, good up here, dude. Unbelievably yeah, good splits. For the five bucks. All right, he made it he through without dying. Very much. Oh yeah, don't die, don't die to the needler. And Kevin landed with one dollar. Random needler explosion would be that. the worst right there. Dude, you know, you know it's impressive when someone in the chat is asking if he's on e easy or legendary. Oh. <laughs> There's one flood bump on this floor, which is very essential. Also, I'm pretty, I'm pretty confident that everything in this, uh, in this game is just, uh, like everything is just a retextured room of itself that you move through. Thoughts? Dude, that grenade got dangerously close to the ceiling there. It looked like. Oh my gosh, they're so nasty, dude. <laughs> the flood be real nasty. Hey, hey, it's nice of the nice of the laser beams to join you. Oh, pre-nade? Question mark. Yep, pre-nade. You really want to wait for a checkpoint there. <laughs> I'm guessing that was because this is a oh random spawn. Oh. If that guy's a reviver or not, so if he's not a reviver, you have to be able to revert and try again. Dude, everybody everybody is pogging in the chat because apparently revert, that is completely is RNG. So like he was talking about with the with the thi with the what's it called? You need a reviver there to revive and, and there, then clip you I through that never door. Really explain that, but if you do that jump there, uh, you don't spawn the flood in this area here. Dude, the chat is going crazy. It's like all the Which stars are aligned. <laughs> He's got a health pack. He's got plenty of frag grenades to work with. He's going to go ahead and bounce that off the wall. Absolutely flex on them. Oh, people in the chat are saying it's a make it or break it time. Here. 
which is kind of... It's not technically RNG, I don't think, but... What does that mean? It's not technically RNG. Sometimes it's kind of finicky. It's just hard to do. to try that multiple times to get it yeah run over it, then this it run gave sucks. A really short teleport too <sighs> this run sucks dude <laughs> dude you know, chat is going crazy fine, whatever chat are his emotions but he is a stone cold speedrunner if you look at chat that's how he's feeling right now but chat is just it, it's uh, just consistent you teleport know? is like a sub pixel teleport or some some stupid shit sub pixel you can't like really align it or like you you can't know if it's gonna work basically Ew. Like you can ne never be absolutely certain Ew, that sounds terrible then to you just you have do. to kind of move your mouse just a tiny bit back and forth and then try again Ew. man i'll stick with zombie speedruns man <laughs> holy cow <laughs> that sounds nuts all this time, he's avoiding dying on literally legendary. A little grenade boost through the hole here. Uh, Easy. There is a flood bump here you can get. Probably the riskiest one. I mean, unless you found some stupid shit like carrier bump, but. This is a good spawn. He hits the reviver. And it's gonna push him through the wall. You yeah, got I, another I got reviver. The best spawn there, which is a human flood from that tube, <laughs> and it's a reviver. That's that's the only, basically the only way you can get that bump like without any risk. It's because that guy spawns so quickly. The other flood don't have like t you know, enough time. So to, like, you would have to you. stay alive until that flood gets there, which is not good. Dude, how many more of these RNG glitches is he gonna have to do, man? I don't, I don't like these RNG glitches. They're making me, they're making me nervous, dude. I don't like them, even though I know technically he does them. This, this run is dumb. Like this run is way too good. <laughs> Something's gonna go wrong. Yes, there it is. <laughs> the doubt creeping in. The doubt creeping in. Like. Bro, it's in this is insane. He's literally going to finish the entire game. Finish yeah, the entire like game in the next 20 no minutes. Improve this other than Everything. Doing, um, uh, carrier door. <laughs> well, you know. Or that's like the only big improvement. Oh, you see the little and flood run I behind see. him there? I guess. Protocol requires that I take possession of the index for transport. Your organic food renders you vulnerable to infection. The index must not fall into the hands of the flood before we reach the control room and activate the install. Yeah, the ev ev everybody's is, up to date uh, on the lore, right? Everybody, everybody knows exactly you know, what's going just, on in the game yeah, right now. You go out of bounds, and then you can. It triggers while you're out of bounds, and when you come back in bounds. Um, Look out! You can continue the level as normal. Ooh, his health, dude. Okay, he's fine. Holy! We can't let the monitor activate Halo. We have to stop him. We have to destroy Halo. Destroy Halo. Analysis of the available dude. Data. I believe the best course just the, the voice acting from, from where it started to where it ended up is is just, it's just so different, man. And we'll cut so, a number of one of those systems. sentinels got stuck in the wall, which is pretty bad, actually. Scale, oh no! A Wait, no! Don't say that. Give me a checkpoint here. Don't say that, Garish. I'm going to search what's left of the Covenant battle net and, and see sometimes if I can this doesn't work. But it's so gonna work this time. Have a checkpoint here. 
course we can use them to destroy Halo. But that worked fine. Let's go. Dude, if you look at his PB comparison, he is just now getting control of his character again. That is nuts. He is just he's not he doesn't even have control yet. He just wait. Just got control of his character again in his personal best. We can line up some grenades to flip the Banshee. That wasn't the best flip possible, but that was fine. I'm gonna go ahead and grab the whip here. Bro. The, I love the Banshee strats, dude. He's gonna go ahead and hit this. I haven't located the crash site yet. Hit this trigger so we time. can go to the next area. The monitor or his sentinels find a way to activate Halo's final weapon without the index. Let's get moving. The nav point marks our target. Another commentary the redeemed. The in these canyons are Halo's <laughs> firing mechanisms. They consist of three... I love how he just brings it in. Halo and allow okay, it he, only, he only brought it partially in. I really thought he was going to bring the whole thing in there the whole way. To calculate the pulse's range. Which would have been really funny, but... That's the pulse I'm, I'm going to go out of bounds with a banshee. Don't do it. I really hope I get a checkpoint before I do it. Dude, WTF. Why, why are you glitching? WTF. You almost died to that thing, man. Well done. So, if we damage or destroy these generators, the monitor... Oh, there's another Banshee right there. Easy. Okay, just kidding. He doesn't want that Banshee. He wants this Banshee. And... Okay. No, that's good. No, that makes sense. Yeah. What just happened right there? What just, what, what just kind of weird effect happened right there? <laughs> I'm gonna hit some triggers. What? I can't miss any of them. Head through that door. That's the way to the next canyon. Wait, is he no clipping right now? I think I, he yeah. So this area he's not supposed to be in yet. So he's hitting the triggers from this area without any if enemies or one. any actual walls loading in, just no, the textures really of the walls. Because you can't know if you miss them or not. There's no feedback of any kind. Oh, that's super, super, super sketchy. Bro, this is so cool. This run is like the perfect combination of skill and just like knowledge and then tricks. I can't wait to watch the other Halos, man. I really can't. I hope, uh, dude, I, uh, I mean, obviously he gets them. But like, geez, this is so stressful. He has no way of knowing if he actually is hitting these triggers that he has to hit. Or else it's run over and he doesn't get world record. He doesn't even get PB probably if he misses these. Du, 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 du. I, I feel like I should I be playing I Halo music them, or something. Honestly. Yep. Nice. Oh, and then now he's just getting... Go here, this is where I started this entire thing from. <laughs> yeah, I want to come back here. He jumped in his other Banshee that he pre-set up. He jumped in his other Banshee that he pre-set up. So he hit another trigger, right? You see all the enemies that spawn? He hit another trigger right there to, to, to start the enemy spawning and then is skipping the level again. Bro, this is a ridiculously nutty speedrun to watch, man. I think I hit that. I think so. And he's he's doing it again. He's hitting more triggers in this area. You just I, you just even have to know because the screen starts like it, it go. You go in like a specific untextured part. You can't even see the screens anymore. Like you can't even see the area you're supposed to be in anymore. So basically, so basically, he's doing like that one level where he just flew to the end. He's basically doing that, except he has to hit a bunch of triggers on the way in order for the end trigger to actually activate so that you can go to the next level and beat the game. Someone in the chat? Oh, I'm witnessing history. <laughs> eee. The pulse generator overloaded. One more to go. Now, what I have to do is 
basically load this area if I can actually finish the level. So I have to come all the way here. Load it? Oh, so he actually has to like spawn the enemies and spawn the walls and everything like that so that he can beat it. I'm guessing. Oh yeah, so he's going to hop back through the wall again to start the spawns to actually load the area. And then he's just going to go ahead and fly on through. And where is he going? And he's flying underneath everything. Now I can fly to the, to the tunnel, like, while being out of bounds. <laughs> uh, well, at least Yo, there's a nice the indicator there. Seen this route. My pulse generator is overloading, says someone in the chat. Oh, oh dear. This is your first time that seeing this route. The next section of uh, it's not like a... I haven't even timed it myself, but Cambit, he's he's a guy who's been doing EBILs recently. He's just talking on a world record like, run! Apparently you can save like maybe 10 seconds with that. Dude, this world record has held for months. So this man, I mean, whatever strats he's talking about, it doesn't matter. This man has, the, no, this, is the, the this is the, this is the god one. Are you one in sun? <laughs> Bro, I having love this guy's community. It's so it's so cool. Oh, and he's just going through the door again. Like that. Okay. Still has his banshee of justice here. And you have to hit these triggers on the bridge. Go ahead and open up the next door. Oh my gosh! All the my flood like jumping at him. Really good. I don't really need to worry about that, I don't think. E. Okay. He's okay. What did he say? His Banshee health is really good? I mean, it hasn't... It, it, I, I don't know There's how much damage vehicles okay. take in Legendary. So far. Nothing that bad. Apparently, you can scrape as many things as you want. <laughs> now you have to have, like, five Flood die in this area. What? That's so random. I just want to make sure enough luck die. Just five. Exactly five souls must be sacrificed. Otherwise, these enemies won't spawn. I wonder. I wonder how much of speedrunning is people like literally understand why I mean, things are the way they are, are and how much time it's just like that's just the now way the it is. Levels basically done. I don't know why it's like that, dude. Look at he's still at the bridge on his PB run absolutely slapping his pb oh nice little launch i'm guessing he's done with his banshee because he kind of just threw that successful tb like that was obviously not you know i basically just tried to f not fuck up anything Find the target <laughs> yeah i, I could do that so much faster like if i really tried but so what you're saying is the run wolf. sucks Oh my gosh, minus 144? One second gold. Oh, Glot isn't supposed to be God, it's gold, but spelled wrong. Like, like HODL. I need this guy to follow me. Glot split. Okay, I see it. I, okay, I understand now. I, I'm He's getting with the, I'm getting with the speedrunner terms here. The garish chat room is, t is like teaching really me. really slow, what the hell? Okay, he's gonna use the little respawn thing to glitch through the wall. Easy. And then you can. So that's just another flood bump, just like on library. <laughs> he's not supposed to be in this area yet, so they're all just T posing, waiting for him to spawn. That's great. That's uh, this, great. This level is actually the shortest level in the run. Oh, wait, yeah, he's actually, like, Be really close to wait. beating it already. Best split Ooh. time by a fucking minute? <laughs> okay, I guess that makes sense. He's a minute ahead. He's finally <laughs> happy. Is, this run is gonna fail you so hard. Like, <laughs> basically nothing has gone wrong on this entire run. Like, what something's gonna fucking us? fail. <laughs> Something has to fail. I love it. Oh, I don't have time to drink. It's done. I 
have the code. I have the code. I'm gonna switch to back to the average. Let's go back to oh, the that's not the average. Find a ride. Don't pay attention. You're on the world record run. Stop messing with your splits, you I crazy. I don't want to look at BB splits, honestly. I'd rather look at average splits. Because then I then I am not actually sure how much how much ahead I am. Mm, that shotgun. Oh my gosh, that shotgun got him to such low health. So average splits. So his PB. So he has several different ways he can compare well, it. What he and what he usually like five gets. Five seconds right now. Oh my gosh, did he just pre nade that shit. Yeah, this level is really short. That's unbelievable. Um, it's just one trick, and the the end of the level is basically where the start of the level is, or like really close. So literally just you just do one flood bump to skip the entire level almost. Yeah, and like half this level was a cutscene, dude. Oh my gosh, he's actually taking damage in the cutscene too. <laughs> what the hell? Here we go. Minus 152. Yo, flying frog, thanks for the On bits. his average segments? All right, here we go. 108.16. This is the last split. This is it. The we last split. The bridge. From there, we can use the captain's neural implant this is to it. initiate an overload of the ship's fusion engines. The explosion should damage enough systems below it to destroy the ring. Oh my gosh, big, big boy nade from there. So he, he, he like pre-grabbed that shotgun from the dude he killed there. Okay. Yeah, let's just go ahead and skip all that. He used the door opening to clip him through the wall and he landed on the ceiling somehow. Got the shot. Oh, apparently that shotgun isn't 100%. Uh, apparently getting the shotgun is RNG, but it's good to get the shotgun. Dude, I'm I'm so I would be so lost. If I did this, I would just reload a save point, man. Instead of just actually using it to my advantage to beat the level. These jumps look really precise. These jumps look really, really, really precise. I took that so slowly. I didn't wanna I didn't wanna fuck up anything. I, 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 I had to take oh it me. so slowly. Don't <laughs> when you get RNG, you just go for the safe strats. It's always better to be lucky than be good. That's what I've learned. Oh, the overshield. I was like, how did that man ju just, like, how did that man just live right there? And I realized that he had the overshield. Yeah, losing overshield there is fine because I still have full health. I still have full health, so that's fine. Yes, yeah, rocket shotties. Anyway. Rocket shotties right here. Where's the where's the shoddy snipes game mode? Dude, Halo Halo's combat is so interesting because that you literally like there are very specific ranges in which things are good, and if you go anything outside of that range, they're absolutely useless. Alert! The monitor Whoa. has disabled all command access. Okay, so it's just, I have really low health now, which can be a problem if I get unlucky enough. So his actual health health is very low. Don't worry, I have access to all of the reactor schematics and procedures. I wonder if there's any chance that do dudes spawn health packs? I think health packs are just sitting around. Because his shields are all the way recharged, but his health is not. complete. We have a straight shot into the fusion reactor. We need a catalyst explosion to destabilize the magnetic field surrounding the fusion cell. What the hell? <gasps> no! I recommend a grenade or rocket. If you run out of explosives, I somehow didn't have enough time. That's weird. Oh my gosh! Well, he only lost I mean, like I guess okay, I guess that makes sense. Three or four seconds on that, but because, goodness uh, gracious! Because I, I couldn't do the combo jump. You know the combo. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Of course. The rocket and grenade. Oh, did he just wait? Did he just phase through the bottom of the elevator? Imagine you're already fighting Chief, Master Chief, down, right? And he just starts like phasing through the bottom of an elevator to start killing you. Cortana to Echo 419. Come in, Echo 419. Yeah, that, that's, that's okay. That's like by any time, honestly. That's okay. That's okay. I want him to get a health pack I'm, so it can be good. So I wouldn't say that this mod has been good, but it has been good enough. Right. Poggies! 
Dude, for I me, hello? I always get really upset when I don't get good moss, like, on good runs, because feels like I'm throwing away the opportunity. This run can still die very easily, trust me. Stop! Don't say that, man! Okay, so what I'm gonna try to do... I saw somebody mention it. Is I'm gonna switch between oh my gosh, classic this is and new graphics multiple times before the frame drops usually happen. Don't try something I new in the world record helps, run. But I don't lose any time by doing that. So apparently there's you know, a problem with the game. Couple of times. Oh, so he is playing the Master Chief Collection, but he's playing it on. I see. And well. I What's see. He's playing the Master Chief Even Collection and he's switching it between the new and the like old graphics there to stop with like a bug that you get there. With no warning. With no way to avoid it. So it's literally the same game. It's just like you the know, graphics you see are these different. Here? That's so cool, dude. Right before the end, there's a hallway where you splatter a flood. And if. The, one of the flood drops a grenade and it happens to land in the fire. It instantly explodes and you get flipped over and you can just die instantly. <gasps> that sounds ter what a terrible way to lose an RNG martyrdom, dude. It doesn't happen, but it's possible. An R RNG martyrdom to to kill your run. What a what a world that would be. Stop being negative. No, no, it's good. If he's if he's being positive, the run's gonna die. Yo, thanks for all the bits. I'm gonna look at them after this is done. Dude, how is he? How is he Sarah still Shadow like? Will sue you for giving me cardiac arrest. <laughs> three. Everybody's typing oh, 360 swag. Okay. You got this found. That was a 301 at the cutscene, or you know that. When the timer went away. Wait, does he usually do like a flip with his uh Does he usually do a flip in his warthog or something like that? What? What the hell? 360 swag indeed. That's what I'm gonna be doing. <gasps> He's going for it! Drive off of this. What the hell? I don't even know what it is, but I love it. Go for it, dude. By just going straight, it's possible that your hog is just going to lose life like crazy. Which is why you can do a spin. 360 swag. You can do a spin. Yes! I are winning some. That's so sick. Bro, he could have just wrote it down normally, but no. He oh, went for the 360 swag. Can die. Bro, this is one of my favorite speedrunners. Okay, here's the flood part. Switching between new and old graphics to stop the frame loss. That's the ship. Ooh, a little bit of frame loss there. Frame dropper of the GLOD. Nice barrels. Even though the frame drop was crazy. What the hell? Oh my okay, gosh, look at all the flood! I'm actually fucking done. I just actually PB'd by a minute. Yeah, you world record. How about that? I actually just PB'd by a fucking minute. What about the world record? <laughs> Here we go. What the f Yeah, the PB, but uh, what about the world record? <laughs> Bro, the entire game, a minute and six seconds. A minute and six seconds. On okay. effing legendary. An hour and six seconds. I don't seconds. think I'm ever gonna do six run minutes. unless I start doing carrier bump, which I don't I don't think what I wanna do hell? that. Bro, this is game man. Or unless you know dude, people have to find new strats. Other than carrier bump strats. I love them. I love them. I have no idea how to do that. The music too. Obviously. The there perfect way to go to out. There. Like. 
fancier look? You know, like, um... SC, I lost maybe 10 seconds. Um... Bro, ain't no one beating this run. EB, the amount of RNG. Gold. No. TB can be done way faster than that. Because that was like a 9 minute TB. Um, but the, the, the shield if recharging. If you want to a consistent TB, Did that's anyone else make it? hard to really cut much yeah. time from that. Just dust you beat a, you um, Dude, that, that is the biggest mood yeah, ever. Well. He cut a minute off of a 20 year old game. Actually, that's well, insane. That one was actually... For the first time obliterated and the in my life, I can say that run was <laughs> that run was actually good. <laughs> I love it, dude. Like, holy shit, I, I didn't make any started. mistakes anywhere, I don't think. I didn't crack under pressure in any way. Fully knowing I was a minute ahead going into fucking more. That's nuts. That's nuts, dude. I'm so excited could, for dude. This just got, got me so excited for the Halo RNG series, on, man. On library and everything. You can cry, Garish. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, okay. boys and girls, EB splits. There it is. There it is. The video ends here. Ladies and gentlemen, everybody, go subscribe to Garish Goblin and please go follow his Twitch channel. Uh, this guy is an absolute god. What an absolutely super fun to run to watch, man. I had I had a I had a blast watching that, seeing all the different tricks. I love how he started explaining it halfway through and everything like that. All the different things he was doing, the banshee flying, the map knowledge, the gameplay, the ac the just like the pre-spawns, the pre-nades, the nade boost, the accuracy. This was a, this was an absolute pleasure to watch. So everybody, thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you guys so much for tuning in. Please, please, please go support the runner. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.